And the last thing is this. Everybody's not going to make it. Not in the kingdom that the scripture talks about. The parable, if you read all the parables of the kingdom, most of them deal with separation. Sheep over here, goat over there, right? Wheat over here, tail over there, right? Listen to Jesus' words. Think not that I come to bring peace. Nay, a sword. See, when he says that all those things that are happening are the beginning of sorrows, the most sorrowful time is when you make a decision for Christ and your wife or your husband makes a decision for the world. So two will be lying in bed and I'm going to take one and I'm going to leave one and they of a man's own household will be his worst enemies. That is horrible. But you can see it now. If both of us are playing with Christ, then we can stay in the bed. You play, I play. But if one says, I'm going to give my life, I'm going to die, and let him live in me, so that greater will be him that is in me than he that is in the world, and the world will not overcome me. He will give me power to overcome the world. Then there's going to be a separation. In the church, there's going to be separation because some are playing church. And God has to weed out his own kingdom because like the Jesus said, you throw your net, you get everything in the net. You don't bother till you get it to shore. And then you got to say, no, this ain't right. You throw that back, throw that back. We ain't throwing nothing back as long as they can tie. So I guess I've worn out my welcome. But I tell you, pastors, I love you. I want to see your ministry successful. I want to see your churches full. And I want you to go after the young. The churches are dying. Because when you look, you see all of us gray-headed, bald-headed, or using just for men. And just for women, too. But the young are out there needing a church home. You go after the youth because as we die, and we are surely going to die, the young should take that church to the next level, build the kingdom, and let God bless us and make us God's. As David said, ye are all God's children of the Most High God. Thank you for listening and may God bless you. Peace. As-salamu alaykum. Come on, let's give a great round of applause. While they give the final presentation, I'm asking, I'm asking for respect. I'm asking for respect. I don't want to see an exodus towards the door. Yeah. I want Thank you. I want us to show respect to this wonderful messenger of God. Give him another great round of applause. You all have to please please if you will keep your seats. I know we've been here long but you know how church is. <laughs> Bishop Pearson, I need you. Listen, please honor the minister. Yeah. There's a